Are you already doing DevOps and IBMI, but your test cycles are long and costly with an end-to-end -end test for each and every change? In this video, we'll look at how to optimize your existing end-to-end -end testing tools with a data-oriented solution for IBMI. With backend applications on IBMI, the UI-based end-to-end tools create a bottleneck that can block your DevOps objectives of rapid and frequent delivery. It's common, in fact last year 100 CIOs in the UK saw that testing was the biggest bottleneck to DevOps. And the bottleneck has a cost. In DevOps we call this the shift left effect. Most defects are introduced in the coding phase but only found late in the process. But the earlier the defects are detected, the less they cost the business. Add to this the fact that most development shops run two separate teams for legacy and open systems. Localizing and resolving bugs across teams that use vastly different tools is a growing challenge. And IBMI has its own specific testing challenges, meaning the core backend IBMI apps are often left unmanaged. The industry standard testing tools focus on UI tests only, but the actual cause of the defect is hidden somewhere in the source code, the database or the batch job, so the underside of the iceberg. UI tests with a manual localization of errors and laborious efforts to reproduce the error can actually cause defects to propagate, which escalates resolution times and has an enormous triage cost. But Arcad Verifier is different. It's designed for IBMI and it shares the same application metadata, the Arcad repository, as all the other modules in the Arcad suite. So it optimizes end-to-end -end tests made with industry standard tools to bring shift left performance to IBMI. Verify detects errors at their root cause in the source code, the spool files and deep down in the database. These defects are isolated and their effect is immediately understood. The database can be anonymized and redeployed into its correct state. Unit tests at program level check that each component works in isolation. And then these can be combined into smoke tests and build verification tests. There's no need for a complete end-to-end -end test anymore. And that's less test cycles overall. You can see here how easy it is to record a test scenario from Arcad Verifier, just by interacting with your application in the usual way. Developers can create tests whenever they add new functionality. Of course, some functions are only available from a 5250 green screen, which is foreign to standard tools, but Verifier supports 5250 and more. It records all your keystrokes, and behind the scenes it's tracking all the artifacts that are used. So the artifacts that the scenario read, wrote, or updated are stored transparently for you. Verify uses this to group together and play back scenarios automatically when you make changes. The group of scenarios is called a campaign. Verify detects what you changed and runs exactly the right tests for you. It even tells you what programs don't have a test associated with them, and that's a testing gap. Campaigns can be generated and executed automatically every time you push a change forward using any source code management system like Git. The Verify's power derives from the cross-reference knowledge in the ARCAD repository. When a developer makes a code change, Verifier mines the repository to find exactly which, which scenarios to execute to retest that code. It'll then generate and execute a campaign and report instantly on any differences it finds. So this smart dependency testing massively reduces the amount of testing you need to do. And it means that you can test continuously at each code commit. Verifier also integrates with Jenkins for a true CI-CD flow. And these same cross-references go further and actually speed up bug resolution. With Verifier, when a defect is localized in the UI or spool or database, the developer can instantly view the exact source lines that interact with the offending data. So this saves days of manual effort hunting for bugs. So screens are analyzed for issues, spool files are looked at for problems, and unique to Verifier, the database is checked for differences. You can compare today's test run with any previous run. Verify gives you a list of all files accessed, every record in the file that was accessed, and it'll trap the values in every field in that file. 
Developers see immediately which data has changed before it's even processed and before any impact ever reaches the screen or a spool file. Let's see how easy it is to compare data and display records with differences. Here, some defects deep in the database are being presented to the developer for an immediate fix. And it's easy to exclude normal differences like dates from the comparison. Defect reports can be automatically dispatched to QA staff for review after a scheduled test run. Many IBM I apps run mission critical functionality in batch with no UI whatsoever, but Verify has a start stop feature that enables batch testing with ease. Verify also detects and reports on differences in spool files. Many modern three tier IBM I apps interact with external systems via web services. Arcad Verifier delivers the same deep defects analysis with asynchronous messages and web services too. As you create your web services test from the messaging layer, Verifier's start and stop diagnostic feature tracks your transactions and all activity deep down in the database to catch your defects early. You don't need specialist knowledge to use Arcad Verifier, you just need to know how to run your own software. Click a button to create a scenario and Verifier transparently manages the environments and the test data for you. You choose which date test data to use and then Verifier protects and resets that data after every use. Verify is very good at saving tester knowledge for reuse later in the process. So developers record the unit and functional tests one time to check their changes. And then these are then reused as an asset during the integration phase for build verification and smoke testing. And because the defects are localized so early in the process, the developers actually push a fully tested IBM I release to end-to-end -to -end testers with 99.9% percent of the defects eliminated. The end-to-end -end QA team receives a fully working IBM I app so that they can concentrate on only the integration defects outside of the IBM I itself. So no more blame between teams and end users receive deliveries earlier. It's a fully optimized and compliant process. But you don't have to be a developer to use Verifier. QA teams, business analysts, operation teams, and even end users can easily start capturing tests. Verify is just one of a series of ARCAD modules that shift defects left. ARCAD iUnit tests individual procedures for reuse as test assets later. ARCAD Code Checker creates and enforces quality guidelines on the developer's desktop. So these solutions help you accelerate your DevOps process and meet your continuous improvement goals. You can quantifiably document your success and prove to your management that you've shifted your defects left. And the savings are measurable. Less technical debt across the lifecycle means you reduce IT cost and risk while securing the quality of your code base. And are you modernizing? Imagine running a transaction the old 5250 way, then running that same transaction off your brand new shiny website and being able to tell at a glance that both processes updated the database in exactly the same way. How else would you do this? Look at each field in each file? No one has time for that, but Verifier does. Or maybe you're facing data protection regulations like the GDPR? So for effective testing, you need realistic data from production. So combine Verify with Arcad's Dot Anonymizer solution to mask sensitive data automatically. If you'd like to see what Arcad Verify can bring to your DevOps process, just contact us at Arcad today.